Usually when I'm playing a game I'll get nice and comfy about two feet away from the television and sink into the sofa, but sometimes my bowels are too full of a mixture of rice, beans, cheese and despair to move my gluttonous ass all the way from my bedroom to the living room. Heck, I even struggle to drag the mouse far enough to skip songs on iTunes. Finding a compelling browser game is a rarity that I'll keep coming back to for years to come. It's like finding a clean pair of whites atop Pounce Mountain. Transfer Mice is the off-white cloth that sits atop the mound of damp, stale, browser-based distractions. And it's a great game. Coming from French developer Atelier 801, Transform Mice throws hundreds of players into a room, each controlling their own little mousy friend. Of course, a mouse simulator isn't a game, and while you might spend your first few hours dancing from side to side across the screen, you'll soon discover that there's a goal. Get to the cheese and then get to the exit. It sounds simple, but like a clean pair of whites atop- hang on, wait. It sounds simple, but you're gonna have to use all your cunning and platforming skills to get there, with a little help from magical mice, or shaman, as the game likes to call them. Now these players have the power to spawn any number of platforms, joints and other objects you might find useful in getting to the cheese. Of course the shaman gets an additional bonus for every mouse he helps to the cheese, so there's an incentive for doing well. But every player that's granted this immeasurable and divine power just decides to squander it. In fact, they actively try to prevent mice from getting to the cheese. So think of the shaman like the master troll. While he has the power to help everyone get to the cheese and everyone to be happy, he'd much rather throw you off the side of the level. Although whether the mechanics have actually changed very little over the past four years since its creation, some people know how to make some quite amazing contraptions. You, however, do not. Unless you've practiced for hours on end or read the lengthy wiki about being a shaman, if you're ever granted the power, the likelihood is you'll be no better than the troll master general. Now Transfer Mice is best enjoyed in a private room with close friends, unless of course you've mastered the art of being a shaman. Or you don't care about getting to the cheese and you just want to piss people off. To get into a private room, just type forward slash room and then the name of the room. To get into a room with fellow subscribers, just leave a comment below with the name of your room and you can all have a little party. With a gigantic crowdsourced bank of levels, every round's exciting in its own way. So you've got levels based around teamwork, where you've got mice trying to balance a board, you've got platforming levels with different surfaces that will rocket you around the room, and my favourite levels are the ones that subvert most player decisions. For example, they'll have cheese that moves around the room, or that's fake, or they'll have invisible walls and the like. And basically these are just more ways to troll people. It's chaotic, challenging and hilarious. A vibrant community and an ever-evolving set of levels means this is a game you'll keep coming back to time and time again. Even if it's just to piss people off and see the reactions in the comments. I'm Marcus Beard and I'm not wearing any trousers.